What's going on today, guys? It's Focus here, and today I'm gonna help you guys get you make Arma 3 less laggy. So, first of all, you're going to want to go to Start and your Documents. Click on Arma 3. This is very, very similar to the way that you do the DayZ less lag. So, you're gonna want to open up Arma 3, select a program from the list of installed programs, and open it up with a Notepad. Of course, you're going to want to make this into one on the GP Max Rams head and that's all you have to do. Click save and there you go. So that was the easy part of the tutorial. And next up I'm gonna go to the settings, so yeah, we'll see you whenever we get there. Alright, so now that we're officially on Arma 3, we're gonna go ahead and click configure, which I already did, and you're going to want to go to video. After you're at video you're going to want to make a lot of things low because this game still looks pretty good whenever you have it on low and you have dynamic lights high. And overall and object and shadow, you're going to make that the lowest that you can to get the highest FPS, of course. We don't need to do anything with that, I don't think. Oh, of course, V-Sync disabled. And right here, you're going to want to make all of these zero, and some of these, well, like three of these disabled. I don't know if you want to disable this, though, because filtering really makes it easier to see things in the game. But that's why I use, instead of my uh, custom settings, if y'all want to use that, y'all can. For me, it makes me have the best settings best FPS and everything so if you want to use that you can if you don't then you can go ahead and use whatever the hell you want this is a tutorial on how to make it and so yeah that's how you can mainly just fix it I guess so yeah bye bye